Hello everyone, today I'm going to make a sound comparison between the Google Pixel earphone and the Apple earphone. So here it goes. Alright, so first things first, let's um, take this earphone jack out. And um, the reason I'm doing that, obviously, as you know, is like uh, two different plugs here um, and um, that's why I have to use two different uh, because of two different jacks two different phones and I'm gonna play the um, the same music onto it and see how uh, they actually you know put it on one side to another and see how the sound is like how crisp they are uh, so the Google Pixel earphone as you can see here it looks kind of similar to the way how iPhone earphone is uh, designed, but it has this sort of wire that you could adjust apparently. So you could take this out and then put it back to make sure it fits your ear. So that's there. And uh, we all know, well, iPhone, <laughs> this reminds us about this, um, this very ugly iPod, iPod uh, earbud. And um, okay, but in the other side is actually the ear jack, so earphone jack that I need to connect to the iPhone. So okay, it's pretty much the same as usual, but the only difference is, is that that is the difference. So as I said, two different jacks, two different phones. So let's get on with the test. So here it goes. Right, so what I'm going to do is listen to the Pixel earphone uh, jack first with this music called A Stay from uh, Zed and uh, Alicia Cara. The reason I'm doing this uh, music is that it has a very good beat sound and also very sharp female vocal. So I think it's a very good music to test on the sound quality. So let's do the uh, Pixel earphone uh, test first and then the iPhone uh, earphone test uh, and then what I'm going to do later on is place them together on both of my ears and simultaneously here to sound to find out the difference so here it goes all right so you can see immediately the good thing about pixel earphone is that it has this wire that you could actually adjust it to your size of the ear and it's actually sh slightly narrower and sharper than the iPhone ear jack so Okay, let's listen to the, okay, so I'm squeezing in that in. So there's an advantage that it could fit right into your earphone, your ear, sorry, your earphone to your ear. And um, that's all secured. And let's listen to that music. So here it goes. It's not bad actually. It's quite uh, well secured on my ear, so it's giving more better effect. Still, um, comparing to Bang and Olus in the Eight, it's surface scratching. It feels like it's there. It's not actually firm. Okay, it's approaching the beat. Now, just so you know, the reason I'm not playing this music is because of the copyright from YouTube. They're not gonna like it, so. Okay, clock is ticking. Here comes the beat. Oh, that's very weak. The beat is, is very weak. It's like, yeah, it's, it's, it's not there. Um, so I checked on the, I don't think you can actually adjust the beats and so on on here, on the pixel settings. Anyway, so that's um, pixel. All right, so let's listen to the iPhone ear, earphone version. Mm. 
Yeah, it's a sharper vocal sound. It's more powerful, maybe because of the settings. I haven't actually touched any of the settings, by the way. Yeah, I, I tried the banging notes in the A then for a long time, maybe that's why both of these earphones not that good. It's listenable, but um, it's um, still a surface scratching, same as uh, Pixel. Okay, we're approaching the beat. Here we go. Right, so there's a stronger beat, but it's crashing. So it's not smooth, it's like bang, crash, bang, crash. Bang, crash, bang, crash. I think it's somehow better than Pixel. Anyway, so that's that. Right, so I got a uh, Pixel earphone on the left hand side and the iPhone earphone on the right hand side. So I'm going to play the music simultaneously so that I can make a direct comparison. So here it goes. It's a bit weird. <laughs> Slightly um, not on time, but... Right, so the iPhone side is sharper while the Google Pixel one is more soft but more ambient, spreading out. It's sharper, definitely. The um, iPhone. Yeah, it's a bit irritating, sharp sound. It's softer, spreading, yeah. So we're going to listen to the beat. I'm going to listen to the beat and let you know. Here it goes. Okay. The beat sound is, um, okay, so here we go. Right, so the beat sound is not spreading here. It's smoother, but not strong. And it feels like it's remaining here. While as iPhone, as I said, is more sharper. Uh, it's exploding and it's kind of irritating. Um, maybe my ears become very sensitive listening to a good ear, earbud, but um, if I were to rate, crucially rate it, um, I guess if you could, you could volume, adjust the volume for the iPhone, so it's stronger, sharper, but it, you have to slightly tune down the volume. The Pixel earphone, unfortunately, is not as good as I thought it's going to be. Um, it's listenable, but if you are really into serious music, um, it's softer, but not as good as expected. You, you might really be able to adjust this right to your ear, but still, I would say iPhone earphone wins in this case. So um, that's my final judgment on this, based on the strong vocal, female vocal, and the beat sound music by uh, Zed and Alisa Kara, uh, song title, Stay. Anyway, so thank you very much for watching this video. I hope that gives you a bit of insight. Sorry I can't play the music uh, for you directly because of the copyright on YouTube, but I hope you trust my opinion on this. So thank you. Bye-bye.